We're going to talk about carotid pain, which we call carotidinia, dinia pain, carotid. And so the pain is arising from your carotid artery, and your carotid lives in your neck. And the internal carotid branches uh, inside of your head internally, but the common carotid also has an external branch and an internal branch. So common carotid artery, internal and external carotid artery. So you can have pain, and the one you're most familiar with is branches of the external carotid, like the temporal artery, the superficial temporal artery, in temporal arteritis. But because any branch of the external carotid can be involved in giant cell or temporal arteritis, the pain can be in their eye, their face, their ear, their jaw, any of those. The internal carotid artery pain in the neck is what we call carotidinia. And so when you have this pain in the artery of your neck, usually the problem is in your neck. And so the things that we're worried about with carotidinia are the Horner syndrome plus the neck pain. That's going to be a carotid dissection until proven otherwise. So you got to think about anisocoria horner carotidinia. An old person with or without the Horners, temporal arteritis because it's a large vessel vasculitis. And you can have traumatic aneurysm, pseudo aneurysm or Horner syndrome in the neck. And then there are other things that can be in your neck that can cause pain that have nothing to do with your carotid. It's just pressing on your carotid, lymphadenopathy, sarcoidosis, other types of vasculitides. So you should really be worried about carotidinia in the eye clinic if there's any eye finding associated with it. And it doesn't matter if that eye finding is loss of vision, because that can be thromboembolic disease from the carotid, central renal artery occlusion, branch renal artery occlusion, carotid pain plus anything in their head, an elderly person, that's temporal arteritis, in a young person, other vasculitides, especially Takayasu arteritis, the Horner syndrome, that's usually something in your neck, dissection, something pressing on the sympathetic chain, trauma cases, aneurysm, pseudoaneurysm, traumatic dissection. So you should be very scared of carotidinia, pain in your neck, if they're in the eye clinic. Please don't just send this to the neck doctor you have to be a little bit of a neck doctor if it's carotidinia plus any eye complaint, double vision, different pupil size, droopy eyelid, loss of vision, because you kind of need this carotid, the internal carotid artery, go straight to your eye.